What's happening guys? Welcome back to the channel. We're diving back into a brand new Black Rocks beer and pardon the lighting behind me. Sun's coming and going throughout the day. Uh, it's definitely fall like in Northern Michigan, but we're going to celebrate with this brand new Black Rocks offering. Uh, with good news, we have some bad news. Um, Black Rocks is not going to be making the coconut brown anymore, so that is officially retired, uh, so they said. So we'll see if that ever comes back. It doesn't look like it. Uh, but now we're dealing with Six Sprocket, which is a black ale, brand spanking new. Uh, this was canned on 10 23 and today is the 11th time of recording. I love getting fresh Black Rocks beer. Literally one of my favorite breweries in the entire state and country, if you know me by now, guys. Um, yeah, I love black ales. I feel like they're so underrated. I like black IPAs. I like dark, roasty, toasty. Uh, you speak in my language. So let's see what this one's about. Let's get that proper glassware and get this pouring. Yes. Cola in the glass with a brownish tinge. That's what we like to look for. And that's what we're seeing, guys, with a nice beige head sitting on top. Dark beige, if you will. And it's very foamy. It's very sticky. It's Don Soapy. It looks like Coca-Cola in that glass. Um, Really good carbonation stream to the top. Um, it looks the part. I don't. I don't feel like I need to say much besides this is six percent ABV and it looks great. This is what we like to sip in the fall and off season and winters. I like it. I've never had this brand spanking new six sprocket. Let's go to an aroma. Yeah, I mean notes of light roasted chocolate. A little bit of like vanilla milky softness to it obviously it doesn't smell sweet it's roasty it's toasty it's good it's a little bit of char campfire just sweet notes of um coffee it, it just has this nice softness to it but it's kind of rich and robust um smells really good i don't think we need to go into too much more detail guys it's a black ale let's uh, see what we get on the uh, taste here let's go to a cheers six bracket Super roasty, yeah. Smooth, nice mouthfeel. Um, get that coffee roasty bitterness that kind of comes off the top. Uh, there's little notes of, of really dark chocolates, uh, Baker's chocolates in there as well, but really it's more on that bitter dark end of the spectrum. Man, I hate this lighting, sorry guys. It's what it is. Um, but it's it really reminds me of like a Perrin Black, which is like one of my favorite underrated beers in Michigan. Uh, this is just an underrated category. So again, if you like chocolate, roast, a little bit of like caramel, nutty, toffee, you're going to get that in this beer. Uh, it, it's like borderline porter-like. It's got small IPA hints, um, but it's 6%. It's super crushable, yet it delivers this big, robust coffee, chocolate uh, richness. It's just, it's a fantastic beer like I thought it would be coming from Black Rocks. This would be a perfect fall beer. Like this is what I want to sip on. Wow, this is so bad. Uh, sitting outside, guys. It's exactly what I'm looking for. Uh, it just warms the gills without being hot. It, it warms you up without being, um, you know, a meal in a glass. It's just, you could put a couple of these away, no problem. And uh, sitting outside of Black Rocks is like one of my favorite things in the world. I wish I could be doing that. But we are in front of a camera right now uh, telling you it's a fantastic black ale. Um, delivering everything I want. It's, it's, um, it's, it's not fancy but it's really tasty um you have to like this category though again if you like porters um and stouts you'll probably like this it's the lighter version of those things with a little bit more roasted char on it um still an awesome beer at the end of the day so hard to get better value at 10.99 a six pack it's another great beer guys um it's it's not gonna blow your socks off but it's not meant to i just think it's a great beer for the off season so uh, as for rating man I like this. This is so me. I love this. For me, man, that's smooth too. Love it. Roasty toasty all day. Three nine nine out of five. Um, I don't think it's outrageous. I don't think it's something um, that's like ground shattering or new new technology in this glass. It's it's your typical liquid, but it's made by Black Rocks, so the recipe's just on point. So three nine nine out of five, guys. It's the brand new six sprocket from Black Rocks. Thanks for being here. I'm Dan. Sorry for the lighting. I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.